What's up YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul and today I want to take a break from all my audio tutorials and give you a little productivity tip, productivity tutorial on how to organize your sessions a little bit better when you're working with your own samples and sort of saving it properly so you can access it in the future and never have to lose a sample within your session. So basically what I mean is I have an Ultra Beat uh, kit right here that I have personally created with my own samples and filled out. Now, since this isn't Logic's um, preset with sounds and I've kind of created my own sounds, dragged in my own samples, I will have to save this properly so I can take this session to another computer or if I give it to someone else, they can use it and still have the samples or I just want to save it for myself into the vault and basically have all the samples in one spot because let's say I don't save my samples on external hard drive. I save on my internal hard drive and it just gets messy. I don't know where it all is. I'm going to show you a tip. Basically, it takes all those samples that you have in your actual session, combines into one nice folder, and those samples will go wherever that folder goes. So how do you do that? Very simple. When you go ahead and save your session in Logic, it's going to bring up the Save As window. There is some little ticks that you can check off here. Include assets, which means all your audio files. And the one that is specifically that I want to show you guys here is the copy UltraBeat samples to project folder. So let's say if you're using UltraBeat, you dragged in your samples from your computer into UltraBeat, and you want to keep all the samples together. You never want to have it lost because it may get lost in the future. Make sure you click this on, and Logic will create a folder like this with all the UltraBeat samples in it. And if you want to go ahead and if you created your own personal EXS instrument folder, Logic will do the same thing like the UltraBeat samples and copy it all to the project folder. Now, this is really good, like I said, because sometimes you kind of lose your samples you, on different hard drives, you take it to a different computer. The samples will always follow your session folder. And that's what you want when you're kind of uh, cooperating on tracks, working with tracks with other people, and maybe just, again, putting in the vault and wanting to access another day. Everything will be there as you left off. So remember, when you go ahead and save your projects and you created a custom UltraBeat uh, sort of um, UltraBeat file, UltraBeat. Um, drum kit and exs draw uh, exs 24 kind of software software instrument tracks with your custom sounds make sure you select this to copy it all to your thing and if you're working with movies copy movie to the project folder as well so that's just a productivity right there a productivity tip right there so you guys can take it to the bank and use what you want with it and just promise me guys it will help you out with your organization keeping all your samples together within your sessions files so with that said if you have any questions on this you can ask me in the comment section and as usual more great videos always coming soon and watch out for this week's the vault because that sound that drum kit right there is going to be in the vault number two so you guys can take a look out for that as well built with a song around it but you'll hear that on friday so all right guys i'll talk to you guys soon later bye